This is Final Fantasy XIV Online. We're on PlayStation 5 taking a look at the PS5 version of the game where we get three graphical options to enjoy. So you can either play at the native 4K, which is what we're checking out now, or you can do 1080 or 1440p, which are all available under the, uh, the visual kind of configuration, system configuration. So you see we've got uh, at the top here HD, it's like 1440, and then this is 4K. So you can also change the HUD if you want to adjust it as well. You can go up to like 300% if you want to change that. You do kind of have an uncapped frame rate, so you're hitting like 60, you know, basically, um, you know, what about the quest thing? Uh, anyways, so you're basically hitting 60 on the two lower options, but on the 4K one, it, it seems to be, you know, a little bit more study, stuttering than that. What does it want me to do? I'm just trying to do my chatting thing, and it's just like... Hello there. Ugh. Stop it. Hello. So anyways, we're mostly showing it off in a gameplay capacity, because I don't really have too much experience with what this is, but I know so many people talk about this, and they've chatted about it for years and stuff like that, so it's interesting to check it out and uh, kind of show it off and give you an idea of how it's running, kind of maxing things out, if that makes sense. Da, da, da. So I guess we should also try uh, adjusting the resolution a bit so that you can see the difference in quality. Dropping down to 1440p. So as you can tell, it's... Uh, Quite a bit smoother really fast, which is interesting. So you might actually like the 1440p as kind of your option, but it, it really depends on, you know, what you want to go for. Also your, like, TV options uh, matter too, and there's lots of character customization as well if that's something you're super into. I just kind of went through it quickly because I yeah, don't really care too much. But I mostly just wanted to show the game off so you can see it in action. Oh my god, look at these things! This little person dressed up with a mask, oh my god, it's adorable. Chocobo keep all those things are awesome. Yeah, 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 what are, we, what are we doing? We're talking to somebody, initiating quests, yeah, okay. So now we gotta go talk with somebody up in the big kingdom area. Ooh, the door opens, how exciting. Yeah, this is mostly just to give you an idea of how it's running and looking on the platform. That was my biggest goal here. And a cutscene. It's not even... it's very... it's very choppy. <laughs> I mean, if I have to... Whoa! Oh, ooh, I wanted to get to know these people. Yeah, that, that sounds way more fun. <laughs> I want what they're doing. Sure. What am I mute? Did you just do like a hand gesture thing? Be like, yo. Does it just ring off the tongue? I don't think it does. That guy's got a monocle. Why would they do this in the Hall of Heroes? Mm. 
Yay. So excited to be here. Like I said, I've heard legendary things about this one. It's a lot of dialogue. It does look really sharp in the 4K though. I got eavesdropping. Quest accepted, oh my god. Mm-hmm. Nothing. Tune yourself to the city, visit the Gladiators Guild, listen to Sarkar's exploits of the markets. The Smith, okay. Now we get to explore the vibrant world. It looks like it's nighttime. I talked to that person for so long, it's nighttime now? Unbelievable. Yeah, definitely better optimized I think for 1440p is probably your your best bet on this one I think that's what we're gonna go to just so it's like running a lot smoother this is, this is not great I just want to ride the Chocobos I'm taking a whole bunch of quests and I'm not even prepared for it. No, this is thrilling. They really do not hold your hand on this one. Anyways, let's follow the objective path and get over there. You're welcome. I leveled up by just handing over an item. Wow. Tune yourself, isn't the letters the old listening to the explanation of the markets? That sounds like a lot of work. Hmm. Seems like a really riveting experience where they don't really guide you along that intensely. Shrew pelts? Ah, <gasps> a moogle. I have no idea about that. Anyways, handing over items. He already did that. What? Hmm. Oh my god. I get rid of this big stupid thing in the sky. I don't want to target that guy. Oh man. I 
Okay. There we go. Now we don't have all these things marking up our screen. What the heck? Is he like auto running? What is going on there? Independent arms? Hmm. It's a very weird market area. Does anybody know where the Gladiators Guild is? The Steps of Thal. Ah, oh, there are a lot of little quest things in this one, isn't there? Oh, it's the Gladiator's Guild! Can you teach me the ways of the Gladiator? I have joined now. I feel like a true champion. Teach me the ways, oh powerful gladiator, leader person. This final fantasy is so final. The Skyward Sword with Zelda? Thank you, young one. Slay huge hornets. Okay. The Coliseum. Can I do that in the Coliseum? The Coliseum sounds pretty awesome. Can I ride the Chocobo? Achievement unlocked. Hooray. So I have to just hold this down the whole time to do combat? That's weird. A little ladybug? I can do first person. Well, that kind of looks majestic. Oh my god, this stuff is just annoying that pops up in the middle of the screen. Oh, there we go. I don't have to hold it down. Or not. There we go. Is it just auto fight? Oh, okay. That's riveting. Huh, okay.
But I can unleash abilities to make it die faster. Wow. Huge hornets. Whoa, look at that huge tortoise thing. Marmots, hornets, shrews, marmots, these things. No, I already slayed these things. Ladybugs. Wow, look at that thing. That's crazy. Ladybugs. Cactuars. There's cactus enemies. Where are the snapping shrews? Cactuars. Brass blades. Where do you even find this stuff? Hammerlay. These hub worlds are pretty tiny too. Can I kill one of these things? I don't really want to. It just looks like it's minding its own business. Just being the best cactus thing it can be. Marmots. Huge hornets. There's like a lot of marmots around here. Hmm. This is really exciting. Definitely uh, quite a title. I certainly see why this, is, uh, this has been praised so highly by so many. Hammer beaks. Those are also not what I'm looking for. It is kind of a majestic landscape. The fate system. What is that? I am here to help. Against these three headed things that will surely kill me. Why is this guy just watching? Are they like the things I need to kill over here? Midge swarms. Maybe I need to go to a different area. Oh my god, the thing's still following me. Just saying, these knights are not very effective at their jobs. This has to be like one of the most disorganized MMORPGs I think I've ever played. Like, I'm assuming if I go that way, maybe there'll be more stuff? Or maybe I'm not supposed to even be in this area. Like, these guys are like way higher levels than I am. But at least they're entirely leaving me alone, which is nice. Yes, the fate system. Blah, 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 blah. Striking dummies. The Aetherite found inside the city. I don't even know what that is. Oh, the cactus are hilarious. That cactus is moving. That's really unsettling. Let's fight a ladybug, though. Although I feel bad because ladybugs are kind of awesome. Down you go, ladybug. You'll think twice before attacking us next time. Hmm. At least we've been showing it off. Yeah, I think 1440 is probably the way to go on this one when it comes to like the performance and resolution. At least at the current point in time. Yeah. Because it definitely just can't seem to handle that native 4K properly. Whereas this actually feels decent. It just it's quite a you know visual little drop, quite honestly, but not the biggest deal in the world. And that's Final Fantasy.